wherever, uh, and they just want to get content up. And it's horrible content. And one of the things I, I would, you know, suggest, like Chelsea, I just saw Chelsea on, she's an excellent content writer. Well, go to a company that specializes in content, you know, or copywriting, or at least if you don't want to do that, say you're early into your Amazon business and you're trying to do everything yourself, which I wouldn't recommend, but maybe you should go to digital marketer and take a course on copywriting. You know, there's all sorts of courses out there that you can go to. Um, it used to be, uh, lynda.com. Now it's learned, uh, LinkedIn. Uh, I think it's called learned. Yeah, it's learned dot linkedin.com and they've taken over lynda.com but there's so many outlets to do this what we're looking at right now when we're talking about writing uh articles shane we're looking at a minimum of 1500 words right so, yeah or, or a little bit less but plan to add to it in the very near future right so and the reason for that is let's say you add another 250 words uh maybe within the quarter or another 250 words um, what that does is the, um, Google will re-index it. And so you're going to be constantly refreshing just like this. Thank you. Replenishing a <laughs> cup of coffee. But it's similar to that. You know that um, Google will come back, check it out, and then it's going to re-index you, which is, which is great. Now, the next thing to this is, like you said, if you can post it on your own website, perfect. Uh, and, and by the way, um, the update to the Google algorithm, there's two things. The one area that is weighted the highest is press releases, by the way. And then uh, the next pretty close to that is, uh, so it's items in the news and then content. So Google loves content. They've always loved knowledge and education based uh uh, content and they've come back and said that now guess what uh, Shane talked about the a10 algorithm well it, it really that, that's what some people are calling we're calling it a10 but it's just an update to the a9 algorithm guess what they're looking for external content external traffic quality authority links onto your uh, Amazon listing so Let's say that you do this is just one way of doing this, but and I've talked to this, uh, I've talked about this before, but you create a really high quality blog article. How do you get people? Sorry, we had some snow uh, last night and I can hear the snowmobilers whipping by, but uh, I don't know if you guys can. But anyways, write the article and then what do you do? You can go in and just do kind of a talking head video about the article. So you, you want to get into Google's answer box, right? So you write a bit about the article, you ask a question, you know, uh, or what are the top five reasons to, you show the top five reasons, you continue to write, you write another table, and then you do a short video on it. You know, just a short video either on the table um, or some other aspect of the uh, blog article, and you, you, you embed it. The reason why you want to embed it is because that will get people to stay on the page longer. People will click on the video. Now, while you publish that, I know this is long-winded, but if you do this, I'm telling you, this is gold. So you publish the article, Google likes it. A week later, maybe a, you know, maybe a little bit later, you write a press release about it. And the press release will actually take that video that you had just put for that blog article, you can embed that into most um, press release distribution companies. So now you've got, and then you can link the press release over to the blog article. So now you've got a press release that Google loves going over to your blog article, which is education and content based, which Google loves. And guess what? There's just one last thing. You link both, have a link both back to your Amazon listing and it's a complete circle. So you're gonna get the external traffic from the press release and the distribution network that you use. The blog article that's up there, if you just put it onto your website is great, but if you put that through a distribution channel, you'll get double exposure. So what ends up happening is we've seen this time after time after time is because we're driving more traffic, we're seeing some incredible 
Mantra, no, mantra, no, mantra.